Hello everybody, welcome back for another episode of Castlevania 3. Last time we got to play as Grant, and we're going to continue playing as Grant through this stupid ass pirate ship level. I'm going to turn down the volume on my computer because I know this is going to be loud as hell. So, there you go. That is way too quiet now. That works. Alright. Arp! Throw the knives. Most silly Americans don't know how to use throwing daggers, apparently. They have to be a sub-weapon just to make it more difficult. Fuck. Wow, they kill you for straight wanting hearts. That is, dare I say, heartless. Uh, okay, let's just, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna end my career, like, you know, after this video, just my career is over. Like, you know, I'm not, not even gonna bother. Speaking of not even gonna bother, screw the stopwatch. I don't feel like using it. Honestly, the stopwatch just doesn't help me. I mean, a lot of people like the stopwatch, but, you know. Oh, come on. There we go. I can't ever seem to get a use out of it. Hey, I got a one-up. Nice. Arr! Good job, Grant. No, I do not want to go up there. I want to go down here. There you go. NES controls. Feels real stiff. Actually, this is not even NES. This is Famicom, technically. Ugh. Oh, I remember those guys take multiple hits. And by multiple, I just mean two. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Uh, what's in that? I guess I won't find out what's in that candle. Okay, three. It's pretty sporadic. Unless I did. I don't remember. I'm not even gonna bother about the candles right now. Let's just go on the stairs and get hurt. That that that's, that's a great call, right? That's my favorite thing to do. Mm. Okay, that skeleton caught me off guard. Go to, oh, not the, I got a game over, are you serious? I have to do that all again. Oh my god. Why am I so bad at this game? I need some air. Jesus, it's getting hot in here. I'm like, eh, I can go without needing air, you know, whatever. I don't need it, but then I'm like, oh wait, it's Las Vegas. It's hot as dicks. <laughs> ah, come on. All right, whatever. I mean, what, I only had to use the axe once for this guy. You're a chump! He's a chump! He doesn't even know. Okay, there you go. I just had to do a little soft jump. See, as Trevor, it would just be like, jump, you're done. You know? One jump, you could easily clear that. But it's like... As Grant, it's like, uh-uh. It's like... Yeah, I'll work your booty off for some jumps. Like that. <sighs> okay. Throw the knives. Hit this. Sub weapons? Nah. Okay. Whoa, I thought I was gonna about I was about to plummet. I thought I was gonna plummet into the ground. Okay, there we go. Alright, stupid skeletons. Fuck. Oop. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure him and Alucard have the same cry. God damn it. These are all hearts. And yet, the stopwatch, I'm only gonna be able to, like... I'm only able to use, like, a few clicks of the stopwatch. What the fuck? See, they said... They say it's cool that he can cling on the platforms, and yet half the time when you try to cling on the platforms, it just leads to your own death. Yeah, I'm gonna try this one more time as Grant, but if I can't do it, I swear I'm actually gonna switch back to Trevor, because I swear to God, I could probably beat this level easier as Trevor. Or hell, may I think maybe this level is more built for Sypha. Screw it, I don't give a fuck. Okay, god damn it. 
I was like, fuck the stairs. Then I lost half my health. Okay, let's try this again. God damn it! Yeah, fuck this. I'm not even gonna bother anymore. Fuck this shit. I'm gonna play as Trevor. He jumps like shit, but... At the very friggin' least, I don't smash my head on the fucking ceilings when I just want to make a simple jump. I'm sorry, okay? I'm getting a little salty here. It's just, I don't feel like playing the whole stage again, you know? You know, what am I talking about? I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to play the entire stage again, regardless of what I do, so fucking... All criticism is valid. Son of a bi What? What? What the fuck do I do to that other skeleton? I just have to take the hit. I have to. Or not. Okay. Makes sense to me. Oh, there's two There's two skeletons. There's two skeletons. Of course there's two skeletons. Ghost thing. What the- What?! Oh, come on! Both times I try to whip, it just gets me killed. Alright, fine, we get to play the stage for a third time. I told you guys, I hate this level. Like, literally, it's just a whole bunch of garbage platforming and awful enemy placement. This is, that's all this level is, is just... It's just annoyance. It's just pure agony put into pixelated form. Oh hey, the knockback worked in my favor. Surprisingly. It surprisingly worked in my favor this time. Usually knockback is just a conduit for me to die more times, but this time it actually helped me, so... Thanks, knockback! Question mark? <laughs> Oh, come on. You put a cross... You put a cross somewhere where if you don't even hit the button at the right time, you instantly get killed. That That's fair. I can't... I can't make these jumps. The, the, literally, these jumps are gonna be the death of me. I can't make simple jumps. And now that I got demoralized by that, I can't do simple garbage now. Okay, there you go. Finally, good sub-weapon. So Q getting me hurt immediately. Yeah, honestly, I think this is the level where the game finally shows its true colors and just says, For screw you, this game is going to piss you off. Because holy Jesus, this game. Boop. Go up. Get up there. Okay, there we go. Please. For the love of God, can I beat the screen today? Thank you. Alright, please, meet. Fuck you. It's up there. I'm willing to wager it's up there. Where are you going? That's what you get for trying to run away from me. Really? There's nothing here? There's nothing? They just straight put nothing there. Oh my god, are, are, am I about to go into another Pokemon Indigo style rant of If you have empty space, put something in there Yeah, I probably will, just fucking If nothing's there, put something there Unless you don't feel like it Okay, there we go Jump, jump, jump Alright, Holy Water's good too I like Holy, honestly I like the cross. I like the cross and holy water. I didn't know it was going to be there, but, you know. At least it wasn't like, I'm dead. I have to play the whole level again. Ugh. Even then, it wouldn't matter. Jesus, I have to beat another level after this? This is going to take forever. This is going to take all friggin' night. <laughs> I'm going to spend all night just trying to beat this one gosh dang stage. Maybe at that point, I would want to switch to Grant. Or just kill myself. You know what? Let's just let's just end it early. Let's just end it early. You know, if I die before that one screen, I may as well just game over instantly because there's no point. 
Because fucking what what point is there to get there without the other lives? Oh come on, these fucking li liter literally it's the first couple enemies and they are put in the most awful spots. Just to make you angry. Like, look at this guy. I can't hit him. I can't do it. I can't. Yeah, I swear to God, that... Okay. I'm gonna use Grant for the area before those tight jumps with the walls and the ceilings. Just so I don't die immediately, because this area, you need Grant so that you can hit these... Or just get a game over! That's cool! Freaking whatever, just get a game over. It's all fine and dandy, just getting game overs left and right. Just, you know, never. I'm never allowed to make progress in this level. We're just gonna die on the same enemies over and over and over and over again. <sighs> it's just one guy. One guy. Him. That's all I have to fight, is that one guy. And yet it gets me killed. Every single time. Okay. See, the reason you... The reason you want to do it as Grant is because he has the axe. That's the reason why. And this guy, you can just throw a dagger, and then switch to Trevor here because he can make the jump. Okay! Is it understandable now? I hate this level. I hate this level. Like, I swear, I don't think I've ever beaten this level without save states, to be perfectly honest. <sighs> Just kill him. Just kill him. There you go. Okay. Jump! Jump! Or JUMP! JUMP! Okay. Kill, kill, jump, hit that. Just points. Get an extra life, I hope. An extra wife. Okay, almost killed myself trying to make that jump, but that's cool. Uh, excuse me. Dear God, that was horrible. Let me ruin my own integrity here. Okay. Still need Trevor for this screen because... Or just get backed into a corner. That That's nice. You know, literally, let's just play worse. This series is just, let's just play worse on every screen. Every screen I come across, I'm just gonna play worse. You know, I can't do the same shit I did before. And I just kill- I killed myself. I killed myself because I panicked. Oh, that means I get to do this whole part again. Ugh. Oh, I want to end it all and just start the whole level again. This is- fuck. And that means I lost my axe with Grant, which means if I need to use those axes, it's done for. I can't use it. This boat is driving me crazy. I killed myself. Yeah, that's it. I'm just gonna end it all. It's over. I'm gonna play the whole level again. Okay, I know I can get the axe with Grant if I do this. Oh, trust me, this and the second level are getting beaten. Just... Oh boy, is it gonna take a whole lot of work. And I grabbed the stopwatch like a complete idiot. I seriously want to just start the whole level now. Yeah, I'm gonna start the whole level all over. Fuck it. If we don't get the absolute perfect run, it's just, it's fucked. It's over. I may as well switch to Trevor for that part, just so that I don't fuck it up. Because literally, I keep grabbing the stopwatch like an idiot. So if I go into somebody with no sub weapon, and doesn't need one up until he attains the cross, then that way I can't possibly screw it up any further. There you go. And he has max whip power. There you go. There we go. We got two and one. Excellent. Throw the knife. Jump. Throw the knife. Switch to Trevor. 
See, I said I was just gonna plow through the rest of the game as Grant. Mm-mm. It's not possible for this level. Because once you get to this part, Grant clings onto literally everything, and you can't control him. And at that point, you just kill yourself over and over and over, and it's frustrating beyond all comprehension. Really? I actually, I actually hurt myself on that guy? Ugh. And he's still chasing me. What's the point? Why would you keep chasing me if you literally know there's... There, I'm running way faster than you. Look at this... This commentary has officially entered Scrub Lord levels. I can't... This game is not even letting me stay a human being anymore. Just, I can't. This this game is driving me up the wall. There. Use my goddamn sub-weapons. That's just what I need to tell myself. Just use the goddamn sub-weapons. Okay, here we go. This run. This run was actually pretty deezed. Alright, here we go. This guy is gonna spawn. Fuck. There we go. Okay. Jump. Okay. We're back on this area with three lives, okay? I'm pretty sure I can just knock this area out. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Grant for this, because he actually has air mobility. So if I screw up, at the very least, I can try to counter back. I can try to rear him back a bit. Oh, he jumps higher, too? He, like, legit jumps higher. Oh, can he not actually get holy water? We weird! He can't use holy water. I don't know what sub weapons he can use. Arr, arr, arr. Wait for this platform to go up. There we go. Knocked it out. Nothing. Again, you put. Oh, screw you. What I tell this game about awful enemy placement? Like. Now what do I do? How do I get back? How do I get back? <laughs> <You> go, what? <laughs> oh come on! That's a dick that's a cock tease! Screw that! <laughs> oh, do you think I fell for it? I was just like, dude! Look at the secret I'm about to get. Dude, showing off Grant's capabilities. I'm not that bad as Grant. Proceeds to fall for the friggin' bait. Dear God. Okay, at least now I know there's an enemy up here. As soon as I try to go up these stairs. Okay, not that time, I guess. Nope. There, it, just, it, just, it just... It refused. It just... It, it, it refused to go this time. Okay. Wait a minute. Is the boss... Oh, it's Medusa. Can I literally just... Well, it doesn't matter, because she's only going to do it... I, ki I killed her. Oh, it, it's just... No, the level's not over yet. It's just not... It's not over yet. You know, you thought it could end... Okay, we're gonna switch to Trevor, because these jumps are looking pretty stupid, and Grant can't handle it, so we're just gonna go to Trevor, because he can actually handle these jumps. Oh god, trying to do this with a leather whip is insane. Urgh! You can't- I can't hit this guy. I need Grant so I can- <laughs> Look at the total irony of this whole situation. Oh god, this is taking too much time, man. Now, fortunately, the timer doesn't go down when you're transforming. But if it did, then this game would be, like, ten times more unfair. Please, meet. Thank you, God. See, that's using the environment to your advantage. Get over here. What do... What? Fine! Fine! Fine, Axe! You want to give me the wit power up instead of killing the enemy? Fine! Cool! Whatever! I don't care! Is it over yet? Fuck, it's not over. Okay, this series of jumps, like, I'm not even... I'm not even gonna kid you right now, like... 
Oh, we both have throwing axes. Fitting? What? Ah! Okay. Even then, I would have clipped the edge, so it's cool. We're fine. We're fine. My 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 body is like I need to use the bathroom, but I'm gonna hold it for the next few levels. Uh uh. Screw. Screw you. Oh god. It's like they're not as vicious as the Ninja Gaiden Falcons, but like. They're close. I, I legit just threw myself at that enemy. And yep, you have to do that whole screen again. Okay. That's fair. That's actually fair. Which is another chance for you to outright just kill yourself. Look, look at this guy. Look at him. Oh, wait. I'm Grant. I can just break that shit. I'm Grant. I can literally just break that shit. Okay. Uh, how do I fight this guy? This was probably a mistake, but I don't care. Oh, this thing goes into the gravestones. Right, he goes into the gravestones, and then... The mummy! 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 Shit. Does Grant break this boss fight, too? He's so broken! Grant is so broken. Literally both boss fights put up no challenge in this area whatsoever. Wait, what? Oh, you have to kill everything in that gravestone. Okay. Well, what are you doing? Just get in there. Don't waste my... Not this guy again! Okay, is he actually gonna freaking try to Hulk smash me this time? Because his main thing is that you... Nope, it's broken. It's broken again. That was a flawless victory with Grant. I'm willing to wager those projectiles could hurt you. How long did I spend on this level? 22 minutes? 22 minutes on one level? Jesus Christ. That is unacceptable. Wow, the series might be way shorter because of my uh, approach to this game. But yeah, that was just one level. Okay, now we're in the castle. This is where the true horror begins. Oh, yeah, an extra life. Oh no, those platforms, you know what those scream? Medusa heads? Actually, they'll just keep giving me these bone dragon guys. I don't... I don't know what their real names are, but I just call them Bone Dragons, because... Oh, it's one of these levels. Oh, no, not one of these. It's just... It's one of the stair every... It's just one of the stairs everywhere levels, where it's just like... There's just stairs everywhere. Jesus Christ... These things might actually be worse than the Medusa heads. Because they move in a more flaky pattern than the actual Medusa heads do. Like, obviously these things are just clones of the Medusa heads. They can change their speed, they can change their arc height, like... Jesus! I mean, granted, I've only hurt by... I've only gotten hit by one. God, fuck! I can also chalk it up to Grant's weapon, too, because it's not... Oh, hell no. Not Axe Knights! Okay. Those might only be bad in the first game. Those might only be bad in the first game, but... Meat! <laughs> Meat! Give me the meat. Excuse me again. Again, I'm still a gross individual. <laughs> well, I mean, not really, but you know. Sometimes it happens, man. Just life happens. Yeah, dear God, you're gonna hate these fuzzies. They're essentially fuzzies from Mario. 
<laughs> yeah, those things straight are fuzzies. What am I talking about? <laughs> it's probably... Oh, God, what a stack! Oh, come on, a staggered scrolling area. I just got to the castle! This isn't... We're not in, like, stage seven where, like, everything just goes to shit, you know? It's like, no, no, no. I literally just got here. Oh, I actually didn't hit myself. That's... Alright, fine, just take the hit. Who cares? I'm pretty sure the end is right here anyway. Yeah, it is. Nope, not those things. Not gonna deal with you. I'm just going for progress here. That's literally all I'm trying to push for. It's like, screw the supplies. Literally all I need is to not deal with the sax knight. I want to tell you guys right now, Grant is the cheesiest thing ever. What is this? How are you not supposed to use hearts in this area? Oh, come on. Yeah, I think the answer is simple to the question I just asked. You just don't. You'd be a total sniper. That's what you are. Oh, hey, he can actually duck under those. Alright, that one's a straight troll. I don't know what to... Oh, fuck. Oh my god, this is just... What? You see why nobody likes stairs in classic Castlevania? That's why. You know, it's like, they were bad and... Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, Frankenstein's right here. Right, it's Frankenstein. Well, actually... Technically, it's the Frankenstein monster, but, you know. Do you know anybody who actually calls him that? God damn it. God damn it. What? Are, are you... Are you kidding me? Are you are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What? You have to go through the whole stair? Oh, this game. This game just entered a new dimension of rude. That is some Ninja Gaiden bullshit right there. Ninja Gaiden bullshit. Instead of just putting me back where the crows were, it just was like, you're playing this again. After you just lost all your sub-weapons. So if you just got to this area because you had sub-weapons, that means you're basically not beating this area again, unless you play the entire level. That is screwed up. So basically, this area's gotta be done perfect. Alright, we knocked out one crow. We knocked out... <laughs> Dude, I swear to god, I, I'm not gonna edit this video, but if anybody wants to, forget edit Nightwish in there. I want that. I want that so bad. Just give me the da 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 right there, because dear god, I saved myself. I hardcore saved myself. Oh, there it is. It's right there. Grab it. There. Alright, how do we cheese this guy? That's how you cheese, Frankenstein! That's how you do it! That's how you cheese Frankenstein! Gimme that. How about that? Blah 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 
All right, so I'll probably have to look up a Grant playthrough where they took this path, but I think the next episode might be the finale. Dang, if I can beat this, this game and Castlevania three in uh four, no, this game in Castlevania three, yes. So redundant, much redundant. No, this game and Ninja Gaiden both were in four episodes. That's weird. That means I'll have to do three episodes or something. Ugh. That's the way the cookie crumbles. That's the way things happen. That's the way life happens. Sometimes you just, you know, you're wandering along, and then all of a sudden, you, your game ends up being a lot shorter than you realized. Hey, you know what? It's Nintendo, so who cares? Anyway, next time on Castlevania 3, I think we might end up beating it. I'm not sure, but I think we might be able to. So, I'll see you all next time. Only you can prevent forest fires.